Dear members of the Oppo Rancis's fan community, we are on the verge of a new year. A year that happens to be a part of the second decade of the 21st century. The year that is wrapping up, known as 2020, 2020, whatever you want to call it, has been simply disastrous for many. Many, many, many people, in fact, many members of this very community I am now addressing, whether they be friends, colleagues, fellow voice actors, or even enemies or adversaries, have considered this particular year absolutely horrendous. And while my opinion on the year as a whole definitely differs, and is the exact opposite of what many claim it is, I can definitely understand the points of so many members of this community and see why this year has been disappointing for them, to say the least. Nevertheless, I feel that even for those who have experienced many, many, many negatives in this particular year, must understand that negativity is unfortunately, and this is very unfortunate, unfortunately, uh, negativity is much easier to influence you than positivity is. And I feel that the only way that those who despise this particular year can make 2021 better is by embracing the positives that have happened in this year, no matter how small or large they were. Negativity will always be present. It is unescapable. And the only way we can fight it is by embracing the positivity, the happiness, the joy, all of the good emotions out there, and remembering this year for them, not letting wicked, twisted feelings that have unfortunately possessed our hearts many times throughout this particular year influence us and hope for a better year by understanding that this one does have some positives, even if they are small, and embracing the fact that it's not completely horrendous. Let me give you some of my examples. For me, by far the worst year of my life as a whole has been uh, 2018. 2018 was absolutely horrendous for me. I could not stand it. But looking back on it, I truly do regret how I ended that year. Because have I, had I had a more different mindset, had I embraced the positives of that year, even if there were little, I would have had a much better time and I would have celebrated the new year much better. Which is why all I ask of my fans as a humble request, as a plea, is for you to forget the negativity and embrace the positivity of 2021 and the end of 2020. We have unfortunately had many unfortunate passings this year. Many mem A member of my family had passed away. But we must find joy in every unfortunate occurrence. We must seek positivity. For negativity does not lead one down a good trail. And I strongly suggest that we look at the positives of this year. And each one of you must see it yourself. But let me describe mine. And for those of you who are still here and listening to what I, a simple man trying to make my way through this universe, has to say, I do... Sincerely thank you for taking my words uh, and letting and listening to what I have to say. This year has by far been the most prosperous ever for the Oporancis's YouTube channel. What I have been able to achieve in my career, my film career, my YouTube career this year has simply been undescribable. And I myself, as an Orthodox Christian, and I'm grateful to God for giving me this. And just as a person, I'm grateful to just how life unfolded. I am grateful to every single person who has in any way helped me achieve this success. 
to every single person who shared good memories with me, who talked with me, discussed different matters with me, respected my opinion, and let me respect theirs. I am so grateful to every single voice actor, editor, sound editor, and every single member of the Spider-Man comic dubs, issues one for free, for allowing me to bring this story to life in a way that has rarely been done on YouTube before. I am grateful to everyone who has been involved with the project known as the Darth Mole 2000 motion comic, for allowing me to create this what some call masterpiece, I don't call it a masterpiece, I think it's far from a masterpiece, but I am grateful for those who call it a masterpiece, and I am grateful for those who helped with it, for making it so good, because I am happy with how it turned out, and I am grateful for everyone for letting me be it be that way. And I would also like to thank all of my friends, whether, no matter who they are, um, whether it is my wonderful collaborator of the channel, Alexei, whether it be the wonderful voice actors who have also acted in the comic dubs known as George, Daniel A, Leo, all of them have been detrimental? Is, is that a word? Detrim- if that's something negative, I'm so sorry. I think it's a good word. Detrimental to the success of the YouTube channel this year and I could not praise all of you enough All of you happen to be absolutely fantastic human beings and I'd also like to give immense praise to my actors and my other collaborators my special effects artists my composers for um, allowing me to create my wonderful movie which will uh, be released very soon in January this year I want to thank everyone who helped me with the Imperial Rule, a star, an hour-long, hour-long, imagine that, hour-long Star Wars audio drama that will be released this year. I want to thank all of you who have helped me in this, and I want to help all of those, including Corbini and Galloway, for helping me uh, with uh, the video known uh, as I'm 15 with some and the Spider-Man issue free soundtrack with some amazing music, original music, and I'd also like to thank and express my deepest gratitude to Luke Andrew Walker and Patrick Horhensen for doing incredible reactions to my YouTube content. This year has been amazing for my YouTube channel and while it has been terrible for travel as I have barely traveled anywhere in this particular year, I am willing to look past that because I am because I know that there is more great stuff yet to come and that what I have been able to achieve in my film career with my upcoming movie, The Wonderful Inspector, The Incredible Inspector, and all other, is far above anything I could ever hope for. And I'm grateful to everyone who has in any way helped me in this year. I'm grateful to God, I'm grateful to everyone, and I am, and I am here to say a Happy New Year to all those who are, ex who are expecting it to be good, and it will be good, that's what we must hope for. And I hope that everyone will have some of the most joyous memories they could ever hope for. Happy New Year, folks! Happy New Year, Oporensis' fan community, and have a great day!